three questions I always ask every person that's on this show as of late. This has been a new trend within probably the last month or two. Um, so the first one is, if you could go back to when you first started in your profession, what is one or two pieces of wisdom that you would give to that kid, that 20-year-old, you know, however old you were when you first started out kind of on this venture? Retrospectively, what would you, what would you give us some advice to someone just getting rolling? I'd say get an MBA. <laughs> <laughs> Learn business management. Our friends at Clear University will be very exactly. happy to hear you say that. We'll pull exactly. that out as a snippet and send it to them. <laughs> anyone can own a business. Anyone can run a business. But you know, running a business scientifically, uh, it, it, it's a, there's a steep learning curve if, if you don't, aren't educated in it. Yeah, absolutely. Especially if you want to scale it, right? You know, if, you, know you can stay small and be a one-man band, but the scaling... Uh, it takes precision. It takes a lot of effort, right? It sure does. And especially scaling yet keeping that touch. Because sure. that's one thing that we always excelled at was that that personal warmth over the counter, face-to-face -face with the customer. And that's another thing I'm building in now is keeping that, but it's more of a digital interaction. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Uh, the second question is, if you, uh, if you look at all of the technology that's in existence right now, what, what is your favorite piece of technology? Oh, man. Um, <laughs> one piece of favorite technology? Yeah, a couple. You can do a couple. Um, well, I love InVideo. I've been creating marketing pieces with a software called InVideo. Okay. And uh, it's, it, it's it made me who I've always felt like I'm a creative person, but I've yeah. never been able to create. Sure. Suddenly, I'm able to, to create. Um, and then, um, really, uh, there's so many apps out there like JotForm. We use JotForm oh, yeah. for, um, internal, uh, tracking of metrics. I have a, a driver app w that they fill out every day. So we know how many, uh, stops per mile, how many, um, you know, miles they went and so on, a production app. Um, so that's just two. Right off the top of my head, I could probably name 20 more pretty good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And the third question is, what what is one thing that you do to relax? So you obviously have, you know, a lot of logistics in your business. You have a lot of things that you're doing, keeping track of. You're growing tremendously. What's one of the things that you do on the hobby side? Well, when I get out of here this afternoon, I'm hoping to go for a nice long bicycle ride. Okay. Yep, hit the gravel roads just west of Brighton. Keep that tie tucked in. Yes, yeah, sir. Getting the spokes. <laughs> yep, throw my <laughs> phone away and, uh, and go for a ride. That's uh, that's a big one for me. And it's it's really important. Excellent. Where, where's one of your favorite places to go? Well, I like the dirt roads just west of Brighton. Okay. Brighton Road and Richardson Road and so on. And then I also love the Brighton State Recreation Area if I want to ride single track trails. But I've actually ridden bicycles all over North America and even in Australia uh, for vacations, multi-day tours. That's excellent.